Hello everyone, in this video I will be solving Cambridge A-Level Information Technology Paper 4 Advanced Practical for May June 2025. You are supplied with these following source files. All the source files are here. Now we will be doing task 3 animation. Task 1 database and task 2 mail merge are already done and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. Task 3, you must use these images to create an animation of two cars that appear to be racing. You can see the image here. Set a frame size of 800 by 200 pixels and color the road and sky as shown. I am using Adobe Animate for doing this task. Take a new file. We have to set the width of the stage to 800 and height to 200 pixels. I have set the frame rate to 30 fps create the stage so this is the required stage we have to color the road and sky as shown so in order to color the road and sky i will use the rectangle I will use a rectangle with grey colour. Set the width to 800 so that it fits the stage. Now again another rectangle. with fill color blue the fill color should be blue make sure for both the rectangles the stroke is set to no stroke now this is the sky background you can set it to the width to 800 so that it fits the stage So the background is ready. Now let's add the barrier image. So this layer is background. The red car will be in the center. The barrier image must travel from left to right. So the red car seems to be moving. The barrier must move 5 squares to the left of every second. The green car must enter from the left and take 6 seconds to pass the red car and leave the frame. So the duration of the animation is 6 seconds. So let's set the duration to 6 seconds for the first frame, first layer. Let's set the frame still 6 seconds so that the background is visible till 6 seconds. Insert frame. Now add a new layer. This is for the barrier. Now at the first frame you can drag the barrier image here. So this is the barrier image. Now you can see this image has to move 5 squares every second. So 5 squares should move every second. So you can see the length of the barrier is not enough. So I will copy this barrier image once more and paste it here. Now keep it at the end of this image aligned. Now you can select the keyframe here. So both the images are selected. Right click, convert to symbol. So this will be treated as one image now. Now we can do the animation on this. Go to insert, create motion twin. Make sure it is aligned at the edge of the square so that we can count 5 squares properly. So it has to move 5 squares every second. So at 1 second 
I'll move this till here. At two seconds, again we have to move it five squares. At the third second, same step we will repeat for each and every second. This is the last second. So now you can see the animation. The barrier is moving five squares every second. Now add a new layer here. This is for the car. So let's add the red card first. Make sure it is aligned center. So align horizontal center. There is no animation for the red card, so you can keep as it is. This is the red car. Now add a new layer for the green car. Now the green car must enter from the left and then leave the frame in 6 seconds. So we can keep the car here. Let's do the animation. Convert to symbol. Okay. Insert motion tween. Come to the 6th second. At 6th second, the green car must leave the frame. So you can keep it here. You can test the animation. So it is working. The animation must loop continuously and you have to save it as an animated GIF image race followed by your center number and candidate number so file export export as animated GIF make sure the looping is set to forever so that it will loop continuously then save it must be saved inside your folder examination folder and it should be named as race followed by your center number and candidate number so we have the animation here So this is the required animation.
So this is the end of the animation task. Please check the description for the previous task one and two. Thank you for now.